Item number SCP-7000 Object Class Thalmio Special Containment Procedures All usage of SCP-7000 should abide by regulations described in Ethics Committee Protocol Fern Flower. Description SCP-7000 is a foundation-produced communication method by utilizing various mimetic suggestions through plain text SCP-7000 diminishes the retroactive generation of anonymous phenomena in baseline reality. Since SCP-7000's implementation, the general danger and hostility imposed by newly discovered anomalies has decreased by approximately 60%. Current instances of SCP-7000 do not completely prevent the existence of malevolent and irrepressible anomalies, although most now follow commonly documented anomalous laws. This has made overall containment and research significantly easier. An increase in beneficial and benevolent anomalies, as well as more concisely written SCP documentation. See attached document for further details. Has also been noted alongside these changes. Discovery Log SCP-7000 was created following an increase in retroactive reality alterations detected by the FRCN, Foundation Reality Wide Communications Network. In one week, a higher amount of newly discovered anomalous phenomena were reported, most in some way relating to the concept of luck. The Department of Memetics and Pathophysics were able to produce and successfully employ SCP-7000 during this time. Due to the immense level of harm such entities presented, SCP-7000 was originally intended to neutralize those responsible through lethal memetic hazards. This decision was later revised upon confirming the possibility of a set k class reality failure scenario. An alternative, non-lethal form of mimetic suggestion was then created, which successfully nullified the influence of numerous entities. Despite being approved by a majority of leading Foundation personnel, the Ethics Committee expressed dissatisfaction, opting for a clear physiological evaluation of these entities before further use of SCP-7000. Two months postponement was approved and access to a majority of Foundation documentation for psychological study was granted. An initial set of newly improved memetic agents were finally produced using the Ethics Committee findings as a basis. These were intended to reduce hostile anomalous activity whilst retaining favorable standing with these entities until means of clear communication could be developed. This proposal was finally agreed upon by all leading Foundation personnel after the latest SCP-7000 instance proved the most effective. A log of currently utilized instances can be found below. Warning! Potent memetic hazards ahead! The following is a list of SCP-7000 instances that have proven the most effective against pedophysical entities. SCP-7000 Instance Log Instance Number 4 Message Please take regular breaks. Instance Number 9 Message Go drink some water. Instance Number 15 Message Call your grandparents. Instance number 59. Message. There's a fine line between passion and obsession. Never go too far. Instance number 75. Message. It may not feel like it, but you've done enough for today. Just forget all about it for now. Instance 158. Message. Talk to someone. Anyone. Please. Instance 159. Message. Seriously, it's a community. Go make friends. Instance 241. Message. Only a nobody would hurt you for not finishing. 
Instance 436, message. Don't torture yourself. Instance 972, message. Always ask yourself, am I having fun? Instance 3046, message. Do something else will clear your head. Instance 7000, message. The number doesn't make the article. You give the number value. Don't let it consume you.